Hello everybody. First time on camera today. So earlier today Lee put straw out here so we could pass from the garage to, from the RV as well as over there because it's getting pretty mucky over there where the animals are. And so that was all awesome. But what he didn't do was take the straw all the way to the tree. Why the tree? We have our gaming cameras there and we always check to see what's happening on the property. You know, what kind of cats, possums, other critters are trying to get into the garage. And uh, so we have it right back here. And we've had a lot of excitement, I guess you could say, inside there. At one point, all three of the stray cats were in there together. The littlest cat, the one that seems to be there most of the time, was inside of the box bed and all kind of curled up in the corner. I think I have that clip I could show you. If I have it. And uh, the big cat went over, kind of attacked the carrier that the little cat was in, pulled out the blanket that was, be, you know, the big puffy blanket that kind of blocked the cat a little bit. And uh, at first they didn't, she didn't look like she was mad at the cat or trying to attack the cat. So my thinking is she wants, or he wants inside the box where it's nice and toasty warm and the little cat's inside the box. That's all I can think of. But anyway, it, it was uh, it was something. So we moved the camera, the, the carrier got pushed aside and we put the camera, uh, we put the carrier back and uh, I went and got the chip. But that's beside the point. I'm talking about that tree. Anyway, it's mucky muck, really, really mucky muck on a section of there between where Lee put the straw and where the tree is and I need to retrieve the chip and I don't want to retrieve the chip in the monkey muck. So I'm going to lay more straw and retrieve that chip. I think that's gonna do it. It was really mucky muck there. <laughs> and so who wants to step in that? Anyway, this is just uh, the beginning of the rains, the heavy rains. It's gonna rain all the way through spring when it does rain. And last year, this ground did not dry out until summer. So once it starts getting wet, it's just gonna stay wet. Thank goodness we got all this Bermuda grass that has grown or it would be just really gross trying to cross the, the property. But it's filling in really nicely. I suspect that by next year, next winter, it should really be filled in. This has been a shady area, so it's not going to get the Bermuda probably as well, and definitely not behind the garage. But um, we're going to put wood chips and stuff over in the wet areas, because if you remember right, this is where our cat Avery is going to go. And I know it, it hasn't gotten any farther ahead. We put that aside um, for, for right now. I wish we didn't. 
Freddie was just out and he loves being out and he growled at Lee when he tried to put him back in because he wants to be outside. But he has, okay Fred. Okay. Yeah. Okay. He sees Eclipse outside the fence line and he's been walking the fence line trying to figure out how to get out. And he did get up on top of the doggy little bed area because he got out once before when it was on the other side by jumping on that and then jumping over the fence. So he's going to figure it out, especially watching that little kitty come in and out. And he's going to try it. And uh, hopefully, though, uh, we'll monitor him so he can't just get out and run around because he's not a country cat yet. And... Uh, we got to finish this fence line the, to detour any animal from going to the road. These people drive by really, really fast. And they're great people. They just need to slow down going by our property. But I'm not going to tell them because who wants to tell people that? You'll become a very bad neighbor if you tell people that. So we just need to prevent our animals from going out onto the road. Anyway, I got work to do, I'm sure. So I'm going to go find something to do. All right, well, it's time to punch a few more fence poles. Hopefully the, uh, the auger will start this time. Last time I tried to start it, it was 10 degrees uh, and snow raining, rain snowing. Snowing? It was cold. Anyway, it wouldn't start, it was too cold. It's a nice 55 or 56 degrees right now, so it should run just fine. I gotta measure uh, measure out the posts, make a little mark, punch a hole. Let's get to it. like I should keep going but it takes a lot of effort.
That's four fence posts. One more than we had yesterday. Yay. So thanks for watching. We really appreciate it. God bless you. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Share it with your friends. Leave us a comment. We'll see you next time on the homestead.